Today I'm trying to go for the um, the Kith Coke collab. Oh, well, it's on. It's live. But I'm like two minutes late. Of course, of course what I want is sold out. Well, I got the shorts. That's about it. Hoodies are all gone? Yep. In conclusion, my Kith drop was some trash. I didn't really get anything except the shorts. I tried for the one piece. Not for me, obviously. <laughs> A hoodie failed. Of course. Yeah, this man gets pairs on pairs. Mm -hmm. Eventually. Alright, well, fast forward now about like five hours. I am with myself, Max. What's up? And... The homie Eli probably would remember from many vlogs ago. I know it looked kind of silly with the glasses on, but it's whatever. Um, today on Fit, I've got my Supreme uh, Camo Box logo, my uh, jeans, my zebras, and these are from Minimal LA, my chain wallet. Uh, so I'm going to show you guys that what it looks like on Snups because, uh, you know, Snups feature. All right, guys. So today I'm going to be showing you a free app called Snups, which you guys can check out by clicking the top link in the description. So right here, this is my profile. You guys should go give me a follow on Snups because I do often follow you guys back, as you guys can see. I try and follow basically everyone that follows me. But what I'm going to be showing you guys today is the outfit that I had on and where I bought everything. So I'm going to be going to my outfits shelf, and I'm going to be adding this picture. And it basically, in the description of this picture, I'm going to be giving you guys the prices and where I bought everything that I'm wearing, from the chains to the wallet to the t-shirt, everything like that. So if you guys are not following me on Snups, go do that because almost weekly I try and give you guys where I bought my outfit. So make sure you give me a follow. So we had some McDonald's and now it's what time? Uh, almost six. Six o'clock. Damn, we didn't really do much today. But we're gonna head to Flight Club right now because I literally searched all around the city, made a ton of phone calls. The only place I can get a Chicago one is a, in a size like eight or eight and a half is Flight Club. And it's kind of good and kind of bad as well. Uh, it's kind of good because I mean, I can pick them up right now. I can wear them around and stuff like that. The problem is they're just so much money from Flight Club. I know if I wait, like if I'm patient and I wait, it'd be cheaper, but I'm not really trying to wait. I guess my impatience is getting the best of me. So we're gonna go to Flight Club and then afterwards we're gonna hit up Barney's because we're gonna go look at some Goyard and some other stuff that they have there. And Eli is also picking up a pair of sneakers today. Eli, what are you getting? The Como de Garcon Nike SBs. Those are just something I really wanted. I know Flight Club is pretty strict when it comes to uh, vlogging in their store, so I'm gonna try the best I can to show you guys the process of me buying the Chicago ones. We're gonna see, right? We're gonna try. Hopefully that girl's working. Maybe, yeah. yeah Somebody us. in there lets us film, so we'll see. Max, what are you looking to pick up today? Uh, I'm just looking today. Uh, we'll see what they got. All right, we're in Flight Club right now. Super hard to film. So I tried on an eight and an eight and a half. The eight and a half fit the best. Did you say hi to Max got the uh, breads, the Air Maxes. This is really risky filming right here. All right, so we just uh, took over Flight Club Snapchat real quick. Shout out to the 14K that we'll see it. I feel special, you know, that's like a big moment for me. Flight Club Snapchat. Cop the uh, breads today, the Air Max ones. Yep, 225, I'm chilling. And then I cop the uh, Chicago ones right here. Something for me and my girl to match with. She's gonna be really happy about these, I'm sure of it. These are my pair. I got her pair on lock a while ago. To be fair, I wasn't expecting the hospitality. Yeah, they're super cool about everything. I just overpaid for Chicago ones to have them. But oh, it's, these are a good price though. Oh, do they got a bathroom? So once again, out of Flight Club. Flight Club was successful. <laughs> it was pricey, but it was good. Yeah, uh, so I got the Chicago Ones. Got the Red Air Maxes. And then we're taking the subway right now to go to Barney's. We got probably about a good 30 minutes in there. 
Yep. And uh, I'm looking to get something Goyard. Something maroon. We've arrived at Barney's New York. Doubt they're gonna let me film in here. Just my luck. The one that we try to go to does not have Goyard. Still gonna look around though. Doubt I can film in here. All right, Max is trying on these joints right here. The Louboutin. Tell me that price tag on them, Max. 1K, boys. I'm trying to be so discreet when I'm filming. I've never had to film more discreetly in my entire life. These are the ones you think? Yeah. Those are clean. All right, Max. Explain how you're feeling right now. Uh, feeling pretty good. Just cop these uh, blue Christian Louboutins. My homie Max is balled out today. <laughs> and this isn't even when I go to Goyard. This isn't even when I go to Goyard yet. Oh, I'm, a, I'm a little scared. Because I, I just want one thing. I just want the maroon messenger bag. We're wrapping up today's vlog with just some footage from the hotel. We got a couple things today. Max, my friend, balled out. So we're going to give you a quick in-depth look on those because those are some sexy f***ing shoes right there. And then I also got my shoes from Flight Club. He got his from Flight Club. So let's check it out. First thing that I got, well, the only thing today that I actually bought from Flight Club. This is yours. I got these Chicago ones right here. And the reason why I bought these Chicago ones be was because I was feeling like I needed a good matching shoe for Blazin' Bub and I. So I got her Chicago ones, uh, or I'm getting them tomorrow, so you guys will see that in another vlog. And uh, some more cool stuff tomorrow. I'm going to be balling out at Sneaker Flea and uh, Designer Store too. That's going to be sick. But these are beautiful. I know I say I don't really rock Jordans no more, but Yeezy Hype is dead. Kind of is, especially for V2s. They're just kind of too many colors now. Everybody's forgetting about, like, Adidas will still remain on top, in my opinion, for... For hype. Hype and comfort, but you can't go wrong busting out a Jordan 1 every once in a while. So I think from here on out, I'm going to be building up my collection that I used to have, including all the Air Jordan 1s that were hype, such as uh, Bread, Royals, uh, shattered backboards black toes black toes all of those I'm gonna be trying to get those back as well as getting back like my military four bread fours DB fives DB fours just I think I'm gonna go back to that yeah I mean you should um, I can only wear my zebras so many times in videos and you guys are gonna be like probably you wore these already the boost hype it's there but it's you know, not the is. same and I gotta say man I think with me having the power of a YouTube creator like I do I'm sure I can influence some of you guys as well to start picking up some Jordans and Nikes again like different brands yeah like, I was whatever. against try it try whatever you like ASIC, Saucony, whatever looks good to you try it out you'll find some dope stuff you with will any brand I mean, except for maybe some Skechers <laughs> Skechers like Balenciagas and stuff I'm really trying to diversify my collection again it was just all Adidas bro yeah it's all boost right now and that's something I don't regret, but it's something that I was like, damn. Like, I had all these Jordans and... Yep, now you don't have them anymore. Well, these were a good way to start back up again. I, so... Except I overpaid. <laughs> Our other pickup from Flight Club, y'all already know. Bread Air Max ones. I've never actually understood your reasoning behind why you like these. Uh, Go I ahead. I like the bread colorway, and I like an Air Max one, so... And it's got the uh, Nike Air right there. Did you know that? Mm -hmm. I didn't know that. Yep, embossed on there. They smell good. Yep, nice clean shoe, size 8. So. And then lastly, Barney's New York. Yeah, let's bust that out. Y'all already know. You already know. First off here, let me see that real receipt real quick. Max Bald. <laughs> <laughs> and you already know, Christian Louboutin, they do the best packaging. So right here is a pair of extra laces, same color that uh, come on the shoe. But Which is cool. Pair. You like it frays maybe? And every pair, or each shoe comes with a dust bag. So you already know. Nice and clean. Go ahead and tell them what these look like. What do you guys think these look like? Five, four, three, two, one. Guess in your head. If you guessed... The Jordan 3. The Jordan 3, you're correct. That's my favorite Jordan model, my favorite model in shoes probably. And as soon as I saw those, I was like, dang, those are nice. It reminded me of them instantly, especially with that toe box. Yep. And with the heel, it just, I had to do it. Eli's here. True. Eli's here. You guys will see Eli.
God damn. Well, Eli's arrived, and this is time for when the vlog cuts off because... Ooh, show it, show it. Go ahead. <laughs> Go ahead. Ooh, it's clean. God. I never expected these to be this clean. See through. You gotta wear some good socks with these. Tadas. <laughs> now that we ended on that last pickup, thank you guys so much for watching. If you could, please make sure you smash that like button, drop a comment down below on what you thought of this video, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Do not forget about my Yeezy 350 giveaway. Click the top link in the description. It's a free giveaway for a dead stock pair of zebras. Thank you for watching. Have a great night day. Whenever you're watching, it's Blazonary. I'm out. Peace.